Ballots were not counted due to a lack of valid signatures. The official results of the race should be declared after November 8th when all of the outstanding votes are accounted for. And now off to some fun news. If you're looking for something fun to do with the family this weekend, Steve and I have just the thing for you. Absolutely. Native American Days are taking place again at the Winterville Mounds, and this is your last chance to take in the sights and sounds before it's too late. Native American Days are once again going on. People of all ages gather to take in the sights and sounds of this fantastic fall festival. Lewis Johnson of Ewoka, Oklahoma says you can't miss out on this or you're going to have to wait. They do this Native American Days here at Winterville, so, well, actually only one time a year do that, but you probably can see different Native people doing their crafts at uh, powwows that come through the area from time to time. There are so many events going on, such as storytelling, checking out their teepee, archery, face painting, or purchase a handcrafted artifact from one of their vendors. Food and beverage is also available, and the best thing is the event is free and open to the public. So starting at 9 o'clock through 12, there is continual events taking place on the main stage, but there's also children's events that's taking place under a large covering where the kids can actually come out and they can build crafts that are pertaining to Native Americans. Johnson says there's something for everyone, and there's only one thing left he has to say. We're just excited to be able to be here and be a part of it. In Winterville, Steve Dreyer, WXVT, Delta News. Now, Native American Days continue today from 9 to 1 and tomorrow from 9 to 4. And also, the Native Amer American Band Ingenuity is performing tomorrow at 1 o'clock. So definitely make sure you do check it out. Tammy? Thanks, Steve.